in the middle of the familiar neighborhood of Islex stands a new 21st century building that makes every passerby stop and look. Being a Bangladeshi myself, I was pleasantly surprised to find that this beautiful building is owned by a Bangladeshi man. I also spoke to the builder. Hi, my name is Yusuf Turk, Director of Quality Construction Management. As you can see, this is the building we have just completed, designed by Iftikar Abdullah, which took a process of about six to seven months. We are very fortunate to be a part of this design. As you can see, how much detail and work went into it. I was really proud to know that the designer of this beautiful building is also a Bangladeshi man, accomplished architect Iftikhar Abdullah. This is a house um, once St. Helena Parade East Lakes. It is designed by Iftikhar and Design Associates, our team. And uh, it is actually a very small land. It's about 360 square meter land. So one of the biggest challenge was in that acoustic part of it because of the airport noise. So we have to engage the acoustic consultant and we try to do it the way that sound cannot really create noise inside. So we have a proper insulation and a glass is acoustically treated glass. So it, it, it gives that very tranquil situation inside the house. And also because it's north facing, we wanted a lot of north light inside. But at the same time, we don't want that too much light inside, so we have used colored glass, which is penetrate about 60% of the light inside, and it also create it also create a very interesting color palette inside the house. And the entry is up there, which is the grand entry with a very high door, and we keep that corner quite a interactive to the corner of the street. As you enter the house, you will see staircase and kitchen on the right and lounge on the left. The beautiful marble staircase leads you to the bedrooms upstairs. The high ceiling, visible indoor balcony, a modern chandelier and the reflections of the green and gold stained glass panels behind you creates a sense of openness that is very welcoming. The space under the stairs is not wasted. It houses an innovative water feature. The sound of falling water creates a tranquil environment in the house. We are in the first floor and we are in front of double head space and we can see the grand entry and the chandelier coming from there. Uh, we choose the color as we mentioned previously is the green and gold, very Australian color and that reflect everywhere in the house where needed. Now we are heading towards the family space which is a continuation with the external veranda. Uh, if we open it up it may be a one place. So when there is a bigger function, we can use and utilize that area. Also, you can see the long view from this balcony. For the privacy reason, we have a quite a significant planter box around it, and we put planter on it. We will see in a moment. So now we are in the balcony, and you can see that that great view from this corner. At the same time, this is a corner plot. So we utilize this corner both from inside out and outside in. 
the plant been used for the privacy reason. So when we are here, when it grow up, it's fairly new. When it grow up, then you can get the privacy of this area. We are entering to master bedroom. The furniture yet to come. Uh, in one side we have dressing area, and the other side is ensuite. Uh, we are inside that ensuite. We created a, a floor which is uh, granite and then um, we make it very simple fixtures on the top so it gives a very elegant um, environment like semi frameless shower screen and the other side is a, a spa with a different kind of a wall tiles which is a kind of a wrinkle on the uh, tiles which gives some kind of a water uh, feature on the wall so when we can see that uh, when the light comes in it reflects as well. And we have a very nice balcony in the corner with a garden so it's a very private balcony uh, to this corner of the house. This is an exclusive balcony for the master bedroom. It has got a beautiful garden, although we are in the first floor. That garden gives a privacy and intimacy of this little balcony. That's the exit to ground floor. We have used one piece marble of all those floors. So it gives a continuation of the floor. And we can get that beautiful texture of marble. We didn't use any scarting, it's all that Set joint so it gives very crispy look of the stair. There is an elegant bathroom downstairs, and of course, a house like this wouldn't be complete without a modern kitchen. Coincidentally, it is the number one house on the street. A great piece of work by the architect, the builder, and of course, the proud owner who paid for it and made it all happen.